What up, Slacker? Slacker out here. Welcome back to Vampire. Now, in the last episode, we found out that Dorothy, uh, one of the nurses at the hospital, was doing some uh, undercover brother, well, under, well, uh, <laughs> underground kind of uh, helping people with the flu. And we decided not to, I, I decided not to, uh, to turn her into the authorities, not to put her in jail, because that wouldn't help anybody. She's trying to help people, and... It's locked, all right. It's locked, all right. There's got to be a way to unlock shit. Anyways, um, yeah, it wouldn't help anybody. She's trying to help people who are trying to get better, and uh, turning her in would just, you know, all of this would be gone. All these people getting saved would would die. So, yeah. So let's go back. I think I have to go back to the hospital. Yeah. Report to what's her face. District is serious. I wonder why. Because I decided not to turn her in? I don't know. Anyway, so let's go all the way back to the hospital. Are you dead? You look dead. Okay. Bye-bye. Where am I going? That way? Am I going the right way? I guess so. Yeah. All the way back. Back. Don't tell me you have to fight people along the way. I don't want to have to go through that shit. No thank you, whatever that was. No. That, no. Don't be locked. G gate? Gate? Okay. I was about to say. Gate, you better not be locked, I swear. Human blood. Whoever left these marks did so deliberately. Oh. What? Okay. Shit, for real? Come on, come on. Ah, oh, get out of the way. Come on. Come on. Come on. Let's see how it likes a bit of fire. Oh, hell. Can I just leave? Uh, damn it. All right, I need to go after the archers. The archers Human are blood. what? Whoever left these marks. Are what effing me up, I think. Shit, come on. Thank you. What? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. Thank you. Come 
Come on. Another archer. Keep going. Shit, come on. There we go. Alright, alright, alright. What oh, boys? They're all gone, bitch. Really? Come on. Come on. Good. Motherfuckers. Anything? 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 Not for me? Okay. What's up here? What's up here? Okay. All right, over here. Let's let's upgrade. All right. How much I have? Two thousand. All right. I guess. Shadow mist, huh? Um. What are these? You lose control and let the beast take over for a short time. The beast teleports itself to all enemies around you and strikes them with furious blows. Okay. You create a shadow vortex at your target's feet coming to life. The shadows inter interrupt an enemy in the area and inflict tremendous damage. You focus your power to boil your target's blood, causing to ex violently explode. Damn. Dealing damage to the target and anything nearby. Damn. What's this? My Where's my health? Okay, let's update that. All right, I think the for now that's okay. Futile police were okay, fine. Let me see. Where can I... Where can I... Um... I want us... I want something here. What's this? You drain your own... No. Let's do that. Maybe I can't equip anything here yet? Is that the issue? 
Yeah, equip something in the slot. Whatever. Alright. Well, good luck with that. Come on, let's get out of here. Is it this way? Right? Yeah. What's over here? Is this a little hideout? Oh yeah, there's nothing in here. Let's get out. Come on. Let's go. Do I even want to go that way? I don't think I want to. Screw this. I'm leaving. Ugh, feeling, finally made it out. Let's talk to what's her face. Hello. I am back. I am back at the hospital. Madame. Madame, where are you? Uh, you over here, chick? You feeding? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What you doing? What you doing, huh? I would ask you to avert your eyes, sir. Or did you not know it was rude to stare? I knew it. Speak up, Dr. Reed. I like a man who speaks his mind. Hmm. Compassion only hides your... You he trusted you. Me. He trusted you. And you killed him. Spare me yeah. your sarcasm, Jonathan. You are but newly born in this world. So the accusations was true. No need to apologize. So, so the accusation the, end, the accusation was true, wasn't it? The situation is somewhat awkward nonetheless. I have not been observed sustaining myself for many decades. I have to say I'm a trifle embarrassed. Anyway, I have concluded my inquiries concerning your blackmailer. I see. Hmm. Please excuse my agitated state. Under normal circumstances, I wouldn't let anyone see me in this condition. I must confess I have not put an end to the blackmail, my lady. Unfortunately, I could not bring myself to do it. I'm so disappointed in you, Jonathan. I didn't expect this from you. Lady Ashbury, you yourself admitted how ridiculous the sum of money was. I can assure you it was all used for charitable ends. Well, you were full of surprises, aren't you, Jonathan? All right. Say I trust you, but you will still pay the ransom. That is only fair. After all, it was you who failed to bring this problem to a satisfactory conclusion. I believe uh, I could oh. agree to that. And since a lady always keeps her promises, I will now answer any questions you may have. Okay. Swanson always always allows you to kill. How old are you? Uh... Why does Dr. Swansea allow you to feed on the patients of the hospital? Yeah. Dr. Swansea is a good and compassionate man. He is trying to find a solution for our... hunger. Until that happens, he is clever enough to understand that I only feed upon the dying. Okay, that kind of makes sense, I guess. No one and suspects you? No one suspected you of the murders. As you well know, 
Suspicion has recently fallen on me of killing for pleasure. But you have my word, Jonathan. I take no pleasure in taking a life. Mm. Do you know about the Brotherhood? About this Brotherhood of St. Paul's stole. The Brotherhood is well known amongst London vampire society. As long as our kind is discreet, and as long as they do not interfere, we have come to a mutual understanding. Hmm. Okay. Why did you save you? Stand by and watch such a promising young blood as yourself be torn to shreds by some gutter scowl. Okay, yeah, what is a scowl? Is a scowl. Not a true vampire. The deformed offspring of lesser vampires. Hmm. It is a shame these creatures run wild, slaves to their baser instincts. William the Bishop did... wasn't the vampire that created me then. No, Jonathan. Whatever their strength and demeanor, Skulls are the progeny of careless vampires. It cannot hmm. be the other way round. Okay. Um. I'm how old are you, bitch? The pale, but may I inquire your age? Really? And I thought you were a gentleman. <laughs> <laughs> if you must know, I'm 27. I've been 27 for a long time now, and 27 I shall remain. Okay. Who granted you? Who, and yeah. who bestowed upon you this eternal youth? My maker. He left this isle a long time ago. Uh, I know this is man, I wanted to ask that other question, but I went back. Your age. Really? And I thought you were gentlemen. Come on, if just tell me. 27, 27. You're 27. I've been 27 for a long time now. And 27, I shall remain. Yeah, 27, 27. Very well. But I believe there is more to this than you are saying. A lady has to have some secrets. Uh huh. Not a women womanly thing to say, huh? What happened to London? How many vampires? I met some vamp. How many are there vampires many are vampires here in London? Immortals are of a rare breed, and we often tend to hide. But you may occasionally meet some of us at night. Will they all be friendly? Probably not. Probably not. not. But remember, even the shark smiles before he bites. That sounds like a lesson from experience. Mm-hmm. Politics are as intricate and sometimes tedious as a game of chess in a gentleman's club. I've learned from experience it is best to decline to play. Ooh, yeah. Don't want to. Get into their games. Do who you attacked know any of them? Have you an idea of the identity of the vampire who attacked me? You mean your maker? No, Jonathan, I have no clue. Mm. But I fear he or she is as careless as cruel to let you discover your new condition by yourself. What do you mean? Every now and then, you may discover an immortal in the deep of the night. Mm -hmm. We are a rare and reclusive breed. Our okay. progeny is almost never accidental. Mm. So usually vampires don't happen by mistake. They, It's intentional. They have to intentionally... Because I guess if they drink your blood... Oh, well, it's an intentional act, you know? Okay, I understand that. I've been away from London and England for three years. This isn't the city I remember. Yeah. Things have gone from bad to worse here, Jonathan. I've lived in this city for a long time, and I've never seen it like this. Hmm. The, the Spanish, Spanish flu has hit London that bad. Yes, 
But it's not just that. I've heard things. What have you heard, bitch? Things Coming. I've not heard for a very, very long time. There are whispers in the shadows. Something okay. far worse than the Spanish flu is here in the city. Hmm, what, what do you? What is it? What is it? Tell me. Fear has long since flown this form, but there is something malevolent circling us. I feel fear is merely waiting in the wings. In the wings. I can go for some wings. When I awoke, changed. I was chased and attacked by vampire hunters. Prepared and well trained. Yeah. Though I can't be certain. More than likely, it was the once glorious guard of Prewin. Prewin? Once glorious, but still dangerous. Yeah. They have seen better days, but all fanatics are dangerous. You would be wise to stay clear. They are sworn to destroy our kind. Huh. You Is it a cult? Sound like some sort of cult. More a society. And like all the best ones, a secret society. Mm. I thought them almost gone. But it seemed they have been recruiting. Alright. Seems... Um... Okay, I know I'm a vampire. Why was I left for... Do you know? I don't understand. Why was I created and then left for dead? That is a question only the one who made you can answer. It's not normal practice. Yeah, you said that. I find him, he will answer you, considering how cruelly he treated you. Hmm. How are I vampires like created? Creating another vampire by mistake, anyway. Tell me. Yeah. This is true. The process is dangerous. It could even kill your potential progeny. If you did decide to sire an offspring, uh -huh. they must drink of your blood, Jonathan. Huh. So me being a vampire could have been a mistake. I very much doubt it, Jonathan. Contrary to the legends, it is not as simple to make another vampire by just biting someone. Huh. The voice is in my head. Voice talking in my head. Is this some kind of insanity? It feels like the voice of the vampire mm. that created me. Right. Hush. Tell no one this. It would be unwise to talk of such things amongst British immortals. Speak no more of your maker. Why? How could this How cause could this offense? offense? Only the powerful immortals can mentally call to their progeny. No vampire or hunter will sleep easy knowing that an unidentified elder is stalking the streets of London. So I was made by an elder. A very old, strong vampire. Or Jonathan was. Excuse my forwardness, but But are you my maker? Are you my maker? Are you my mommy? Me? Goodness, no. <laughs> Only a foolish immortal would create a progeny without taking precaution. And I'm no fool. Alright. Okay, you're not my mommy. I bid you farewell. For now, my lady. Alright. I must quickly well, analyze the blood I took from Nurse Crane's patient. Alright, well... At least I got some answers, right? That's 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 good, I guess. Hey, you! I found who, were, who was fucking following you. Good evening, Miss Halcroft. How are you tonight? I need blood, Doctor. Warm, rich, vibrant blood. Yeah. Okay. 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 Yeah. Whatever. Mistress of the dark. Yeah, bye bye, bitch. Bye bye, brooch. To your nocturnal activities. Bye, Felicia. The where am I? This way. 
This is my home. Anything? No? Nope, okay. Let's get in. Where am I gonna analyze the blood? Here? On this side? Over here? Here. Um... Razvan sample. Okay, analyze. Okay. Is that it? Can I upgrade my gun yet? I can. Awesome. Let's just keep upgrading this. Okay. Well, that's cool. What about my... Can I upgrade my sword? I like my sword better than the club. Uh... Oh, well. Come on. Yay, there you go. What about now? Yes. Okay, cool. And it's a one-hander, so... Razvan Vasily was infected by Spanish flu, but also has the highly unstable blood of the Skulls. Is huh. the London vampire epidemic transmitted through the flu? I should talk to Dr. Swansea about it. That's interesting. Okay, so I want to equip my sword. And I guess... My gun. Alright. Power mesmerized level. Does that mean it's going up? Because I haven't even tried mes mesmerizing anybody really. Oh, I didn't check how much XP I have. How much do I have? I have 200. Not a lot to do anything. Alright, I'll come back when I have more. Let's talk to Swanse. Can I change clothes? I want to change clothes, actually. A war medal, huh? Oh, these are all the letters and shit. Okay.
How do I change clothes? Do I go back over here? There we go, damn. I look pimp. Yeah, I'm gonna keep this outfit for a while. It looks good. Let's talk to Dr. Swansea and see what he has to say. Hello, Swansea. Hello, amigo. Que pasa? I took your letter. Anything else? No? Okay. What's happening, Edgar? Could I get your professional opinion? Please speak. But I mm -hmm. have something important to tell you. What's up? This strain of flu. It's very different from the one I saw in Europe. Mm. It's downright peculiar. Really? What makes you say that? Uh, the symptoms were different in France. I've just looked at the blood of one of our recently deceased. I see. Do you have anything more to go on? This disease spreads and looks like the Spanish flu, but its effects differ greatly. Mm. The London strain is different from the continental one. Mm. This is very interesting. Did you find something else? I don't know if I could trust him just yet. For all I know, he's the one who created me. Well, maybe not. But maybe he worked for the guy who created me. Um, I have a few leads, but nothing I can share for now. I need more time and more evidence. Yeah. I'd be interested to hear your thoughts on the matter. There's a lot we're not seeing here. But it is spreading, and quickly. If we don't act, the whole city could be lost. But Jonathan, we've a fantastic opportunity sitting right here in front of us. A weapon what? of choice. What on earth do you mean? Yeah. Why you, my dear boy? With your expertise and your blood, we could isolate the properties that course through your veins. Think about the possibilities. I may, I may turn London into my realm. It's, it's dangerous, though. Messing around with vampire stuff? Vampire gooey blood? But the risk I don't know. of infection using vampire blood could compound the situation. Yeah. I know, but your blood now carries remarkable regenerative properties. With our minds and your blood, there's nothing we couldn't cure. We'll discuss this more later. Thank you for your time. No, thank you, Jonathan. But as I said, I needed to talk to you. What's up? I have some rather bad news. Why? Yes? I'm afraid it's your sister. My sister? Yeah. She's to be buried this evening at Whitechapel Cemetery. Oh. Your mother published the obituary this morning. My mom's still alive? I'm sorry, Jonathan. Please accept my condolences. Hmm. Reach the Stonebridge Cemetery. Maybe I could talk to my mom? Uh... uh. Man, is that R Roosevelt? Maybe. Man, can't believe he's so sad. Killed his sister, but he didn't know. Hmm.
The pain? What pain? Who's in pain? Hello? Hello, woman. This way. Over here. Oh, now it's locked. It's locked. Hmm. Uh, bye. <clears throat> All right, let's let's head out. <coughs> I die. thought I would have to attend my murdered sister's funeral. Well, you're the one Mary, that did it, dude. I can't forgive myself. I'll find the truth about what happened to us. Yeah. That's that just sucks. I have to go that way, huh? Rats. Are you serious? What is that on the f What are you? You're just... Sorry, i take your shillings. Uh, I'm just gonna walk. Shit. Well, that was interesting. Cool. My sword is stronger, but it doesn't give me an opportunity to, um, to stun them. And, like, stunning them is how I, I, I'm able to drink the blood. So, I like the gun, but I'm going to keep it as a secondary, I think. I want to equip... Oh, no. Like this. I want to equip the... There we go. Let's do that. Who's that over there? Hello? Oh, shit. Step away, sir. You step away. Come on. Bitch. Motherfucker. More of you. Shillings. Coppers and shillings. Listen, I just... Alright, let me the fuck hello now. Thank you.
Ooh, I heard a scowl. Skull. My dear sister. I don't know if I have the strength. Sister, I'm sorry. Or wait, what, what if it's a trap? I heard somebody help. Is that my mom? This way? I don't, I don't want to use powers because what if what if my, my mama sees me use like vampire shits, you know? Is that you? Mom? Are you alright, miss? I, I don't know. Who were Ooh. those people? They, they they wanted to kill me. Why? They've lost their minds in the epidemic. They won't come back for now. You seem to know a lot about them, sir. I'm Dr. Joshua mm. Reed. I'm investigating this disease. I am Shaoshun. Thank you so much for Shaoshun. helping me, Mr. Reed. I must You're Asian, huh? Now. Goodbye. Okay. Goodbye. Shouldn't you go back home, where you'll be safe? Maybe later. But for now, I need to talk to my husband at the cemetery, Mr. Reed. Alright, alright. Whatever. Bye. Up here? Oh shit, there's another one behind me. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Bitch. Give me a rat. Come here, rat. Give me some boost. Okay. Anything over here? Nope. Uh, that way. Nope. This way. I just kidding. More of them. Shit. Knew that was gonna happen. Shit. A glowy eye motherfucker. Come on. Shit! Fuck, man. Huh. 
Holy symbols of or comic the collect okay. Whatever. That way. Ooh, I don't like it. Ooh, is this a dead end? It's a dead end. Ooh, shillings though. I found me shillings. Shillings galore. That way. Ooh, this looks like a fighting area, and I don't like it. Mom, where the hell are you? Since I can't reveal myself to my mother now, I must find a discreet spot to attend the ceremony. Mm hmm. Okay. Let me see. Up there, maybe? Okay. I am the oh. resurrection and the life. Poor mom. He that believeth in me, though he were dead, yet shall he live. And whosoever liveth and believeth in me shall never die. We commend unto thy hands of mercy, most merciful Father. The soul of our sister departed, and we commit her body to the ground. Mm. Earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Mama, I'm sorry. It was me. I'm bitter. I didn't mean to. I didn't know I was a vampire. Oh shit! Why this is sad. Kill my Mary and stick her here in this cold. God awful place. <laughs> These are the legal requirements for the epidemic. Mm. Avery, <clears throat> I feel so tired. Please take me home. Yes, madam. Oh. <laughs> Damn. <sighs> Ah, that sucks. God, he looks good in that suit. And those eyes. <laughs> oh, Mary. What have I done? You you killed her. And you bit her in the neck. If and I she died. Change one thing. One thing. This is a nightmare. Hmm. Jonathan. Who are you? There is oh. nothing you can do but accept it. I don't want to accept it. And what bitch, what are you here? doing here? I thought you could use the company. I am so I hear sorry for girls screaming. Loss, Jonathan. I feel like a hypocrite. It sounds like a bad joke. She was a good person. Vibrant, full of life. Hmm. She was kindness incarnate, my Mary. You're a good person, Jonathan. And a young Ekon. A newborn cast into the night without so much as a candle to guide your way. She had been scouring the most dangerous parts of London in search of me. And it led to her death. Jonathan, don't. I still hear her last thoughts. They echo in my head. Her mind shattered. And... And it haunts me. Jonathan, stop. Listen carefully. You must come to terms with this. You must learn to live with what happened. Tell me how. how. Possible. Tell me. Is it so easy to take a life every night 
and then just smile and nod at those you spared. Don't you see? You're doing the work of our enemies, feeding your remorse. We are weakest when we grieve, and the guilt blurs our senses. And so this is why you're here, to warn me. You felt this pain yourself. You too mm. have endured this. I don't You've lost someone you love? Jonathan. I've lost so many friends. Loved ones mm. I cherished. Pray for Mary's forgiveness, if you must. I'm not a religious man. You may be right. right. Of course. I've stared upon this world for centuries. Centuries, huh? Has taught me to deal with guilt, if not erase it. What should I do then? St. Mary's Church is not far from here. Go there and make your peace. Find the solace you need. My lady wants me to confess. No, Jonathan. It's you who wants to confess, I think. Hmm. Reach St. Mary's Church, huh? Okay. Will I burn as soon as I go in? Nope, nope. Shillings. And what's in here? Give me that. Can I, uh, it looks like I can go through at least. That's something. Twelve bullets. At least no fall damage. And off did sure she goes. A newborn seeking divine consent to lick the blood from the soft and pointy crown. Who are you? Who are Make yourself yeah. known. Newborn. You reek of guilt and pointless compassion. Who are you? Dude, you are huge. Forget your old weaker self. What do you want from me? What? Dude, you are massive. Ascalon does not approve of lone wolves who bring unwanted eyes to our pastures. So your name is Ascalon? <laughs> Ascalon's will is vampire law. Learn Damn. to abide by them, or I shall return as your judge and jury. These immortals try my patience with their plans and unsolicited counsel. Oh, I don't want to... The fuck is that? Okay. Okay. Please, sir. The leech, boys. Shit, are you serious? No, 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 no. No, I don't want to go through this shit. Fuck. <sighs> Come on. Let's deal with this one.
Okay. Come on, come on. Come on. No, don't look at it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, you almost have, you almost have them. Yes, okay. This man stunned me with his face. His crucifix. This is not good news. So yeah, if you have faith in the cross or in, you're able to repel them. Okay. Seems a little weird. No, not that way. Can I go this way? Finally made it. Is that religious guy there, the priest? Hello, yes. priest. What is it that oh, you... you want? I'm sorry. Oh, you're somebody. You you're different. You're somebody else. No worries, my son. I'm still quite awake, having just returned from a funeral. Yes. I know. Oh, you're the one. I've forgotten what I wanted. I don't know. Oh. May I help you, child? You seem somewhat perturbed. I haven't the strength to cross the threshold. I wish to pray, to cleanse my soul. The church is shut by order of the bishop, but I'm still the vicar of St. Mary's, if that is any use to you, my son. Hmm. I have not need for a... I don't need company. You seem to me a good soul, Vicar, but this is a personal matter. There are no secrets from God, my son. If your hmm. heart needs comfort, consider me your chapel, for I can be as silent as stone. Hmm. I've words for the departed. This is a private concern. This is a private matter. I'll trust I've you, I guess. For one departed. They're not for living ears to hear. Your eyes burn with rage, yet I see the pain that lies beyond. I am here to lighten the burden of all God's creatures. Whatever you tell me is between us and the Lord. Very well, priest, as you seem quite adamant. Open your mm. heart, my son. Tell me what burdens you. With whom do you wish to speak? I just know I care for her. It's not your concern. She was, she was my sister. sister. You seem so troubled by the loss of this girl. What happened to her? She has been laid to rest. Um. I don't know. They all kind of seem around. It was an accident. It was an accident. A terrible, terrible accident. I see. And how are you feeling, my son? She died because of me. I wish I could forget all this. I feel responsible. I feel responsible. The pain is consuming me. I have a final question for you, my son. This is of the utmost importance. Ask your question, Vicar. What uh, would you like her to know? Okay. I promise to find those responsible to please forgive me. I killed you. There's no excuse. My dear Mary, forgive me. 
You have been heard, my son, and your burden will lighten if your words are sincere. Go in peace now and live your life in the way she would have wanted. Uh, I didn't mean to say I was the one who killed her and all that. Okay. Alright, well that's all the time I have for this episode. It's getting real good. I love the story behind it. The the finding is getting more dock is between my sister and I. It does not concern God at all. But you just talked to the guy. Anyways, yeah, it, it it um the story behind it is really good. I need to keep updating my, my powers or the fighting is gonna get more and more challenging, but I like that. It's good. So I'm loving I'm starting to like this game. This game and uh, it didn't crash this time. I played it again in my last episode. I was trying to record about three or four times before I finally got it and it didn't crash. So hopefully the issue has been resolved. My computer doesn't get hot. So I don't know why it was crashing, but I guess maybe it was resolved. I don't know. But yeah, I'm loving this game. Thank you so much for watching, guys, and if you liked the video, please leave a like, comment, subscribe down below, share it, ring that bell, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.